fans, welcome back to another episode of Empyrean Galactic Survival. This is your host, Zila, and we are here today doing the Elpa 8.6, and, well, it's past the anniversary update now, it's Elpha 8.6, but, um, seriously though, we're still up on the moon, so last episode, uh, I said I was going to finish up on the moon, and then come back home, and get prepped, and we're going to do the Robson protocol. Well, I want to do, I, I, I was just traveling along trying to find some more cobalt and cause the, the node I got wasn't that great. Oh, well, I guess it, you know what? Yes, it was. Now that I think about it, it wasn't too bad then. Let me put this in. Oops. It's in my. I bet you if I jump out. No. No, for some reason I it just disappeared when I went to pick it up. Five hundred and some odd cobalt ore. Yay! Yay for alpha bugs! Woo! <laughs> really? You know, now I need way more cobalt. <sighs> really? Maybe it just fell. Maybe it, maybe it dropped it or something, right? No, it vanished. I, I went to pick it up and put it in the constructor and it vanished. Off my... It just completely freaking vanished. Okay, well... I'll deal with it. Put my big boy pants on and deal with the bugs. That's what happens. It's an alpha. So I'll take my frustration out on this power station. Um, that's funny. I thought it was on the back side there. It's on that side. That's, that's fine. I'll just come at it from a better angle. Okay, so... You know what? I'll just go at it from an extreme angle. And... So I got a bunch of drones in it. Oh no, there's one. I'll, I can just take that out. That's no big deal. Range is 400, even though I can't see it. As long as you aim sort of like directly underneath the square you can usually oh great now it, it when I crashed it on the turret so now I'm gonna have a tough time seeing the turret right right yeah <laughs> crap somewhere there isn't it now I can't see Yeah. 
That way we can just loot it really quick. Just like I did with the other one. like I did on the last video. I'm not going to duplicate that. I won't record that. That's just why I do that. It's going to be the same thing. I'll show you the loot after though. And then I will meet you. Oh, where? Oh, yes, please. Yes, please. I've been looking for Pentaxa the whole freaking time. I didn't want to jump out. I just wanted to mine it. So, woo. Okay, I got to be clear of drone replacements. And let's loot these things if we can. And there's another one over there. Nice. Okay. Oh, and another. Pentaxid everywhere. I'm excited. Pentaxid everywhere. Although it's going to be just small little nuggets. But that's okay. That combined with the, uh, the trading station. I should be able to buy more. Another decently, decent sized little stack. Oh, nice. That was excellent. Okay, so we got the loot from those. Let's let's go get these um, pentaxids really quickly here, or hopefully potentially really quickly. Let's just take a look to see if we can see it. It'll be one little nugget somewhere. Let's turn the lights off. Do I have to put my? I probably got to put the drill equip the drill, right? Okay, so let's do... Oops. Let's just smash down, because that's a good way of landing. Get the drill. There it is. Yep, as soon as I equip the drill, it outlined. Okay. Make sure there's no... Tab in, tab out. None of those red dots are moving. That's good. <laughs> Okay, let's get this. It's just gonna be one nugget, probably ten. I don't care, it's still worth it's still worth it. It'll refine into twenty. And probably by the time it takes me to pick ten, fly around and pick ten, I can mine it up quicker, sadly. So, in my opinion, it is worth mining these. If it's anything but 10, I'll be happy. 33! <laughs> Alright, that was uber. Like, seriously, that's awesome. That's going to be 66 refined. Okay, so I saw another one. Where did I see that other one? Let's look at my map. Straight at me. Okay. Oh. We've got replacements coming in. Is that replacements? I'm thinking it is. Yeah, he just came over. The... No, maybe not. No? Just patrolling. Okay, fine. Let's get this another one. You know what? He's making me really nervous. He's he's almost within shooting range here. Let's just kill him. Just no, I, don't, I don't want him just sneaking up and pot shot me. Let's get this 
toxic. Okay, so I will meet you guys now that I'm getting the stuff. And it's just going to be boring digging it now. I'm not going to show you three more times. And I'm not going to show you getting the loot because that's just time consuming. Uh, we've got better stuff to do. I will meet you back at base. Okay, welcome back. Uh, as you can see, we're back at the Titan parts. I made, I, I know we're going to go do the radar station, but I had an epiphany because of all the parts that I had gotten. You can also see that we have six laser drills on this thing. I've upgraded it with the uh, parts that I looted from the power stations up on the moon. Also, there was a bunch of other stuff. And with parts, I was able to make a multi-turret for the HV. So we came back over, and I've been multi-tooling these things down. I've gotten a bunch of um, thrusters and blocks and tons of stuff. I think we might be able to just go ahead and spawn in the CV Mini Miner. Uh, and that'll be much better than the HV for coverage. So I think that is the better choice. And that, that way we can just fly that over to the uh, Broken Tower. And that'll be much better coverage. It has turrets on it. it I can put sentry guns on it for to get rid of predators. And, and yeah, it's just, it, it'll be better. So let's uh, continue multi-tooling this. So what I've been doing is jump into the multi-tool turret and I've been grabbing whole blocks so you can't actually get your radar when you're in the turret unfortunately that's a little loud but you can see I'm just getting tons and tons and tons and tons it's super fast So I've manually got all the uh, thrusters out, uh, just so that I don't wreck them by, by uh, structural integrity faux pas. So yeah, I'm going to continue to, let's see, I screwed a couple things up, that's okay. And a, bit, a couple times I've found um, containers that have popped and the loot drops to the ground and I was able to just loot it, so not that big of a deal. Not that big of a deal at all. Okay, so I'm going to continue to nuke this thing down. I'll show you what we've gathered. There's, there's a whole bunch of stuff back at the base too, but let's take a look here. So, wow, a couple full stacks of hardened steel blocks. Um, some thrusters. Up there too. Get all in here. So we've got, and we've got a bunch of thrusters back at the base, and we've got a bunch of other stuff back at the base. I think we may have enough to do this, to actually spawn it in. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna finish um, multi-tilling this down, and then I'll meet you back at the base. Back. I've unloaded all the stuff after multi-tooling down the Titan parts um, and you can see I've put it all into one cargo box here. I think we're going to be good to spawn in the CV Mini Miner and I, that's what we're going to do. Wow, is it ever lightning noisy outside. So I'm going to grab all the stuff that I think I'm going to need here. some more uh, uh, containers, hidden containers inside the, uh, a few more and I was able to put in a couple of the T2 lasers even though that I have six now on the little guy, two extra ones. 
uh, a bunch more force fields, so I got 16 now. Those actually, I think, are going to be good for the Arrestrum Zascosium. Uh, large generator, that'll help with the Neo. Um, okay. <coughs> okay, so we'll see where... Oh, and then all the hardened steel for the Zaf iron. Um, that'll work for copper and silicone. Um, get any cobalt? I think that has cobalt in it. Okay. There, if we need more, I think that has silicone, silicone and iron. Let's take a look. Let's get this drawn in. So we're gonna go and grab the CV Mini Miner. Now the reason I'm bringing this in is because not only can I load up a bunch of sentry guns on the bottom to protect me when I go and check out the tower, but God, I wish it would, the, the, the light is just crazy. Okay, anyway, sorry. <clears throat> this is what I need. Let's send this to the factory. So let's throw. Let's go with the big thrusters first. See what that does. Does get a mount of Neo and Sa. We're gonna go with the large thrusters. Ooh, that added like half the Arrestrium Zascosium we needed. Good. Um, God, I hope we have enough Neo. So hopefully the Arrestrium Zas too. What is give us oh, a restroom Zas too good more neo um, let's check out the gravity generator I'm not too worried about the sathium and iron right now because that I can put the box in for that okay so let's get these thrusters in yikes we're still coming up short here Generator. Oh, that's pretty good. Another large generator. Yeah. Uh, the advanced constructor. Not enough. How about these two drill modules? Right, let's let's try the force fields first. Ooh, that brought up the neo count too, and almost enough there. Um, okay, let's throw these in. And nice, we're just shy of the restroom. This is for a CV, let's throw that in. And we're getting there now. We're getting there. Okay, what are we going to be shy on? A little bit of restroom. Zascosium. The Neo, the Neo might kill us. Yikes. Okay, so let's do these consoles that will give us a bunch of copper and silicone and iron, not like we're going to need it. This will give us, should give us cobalt, right? We're at 600. Yeah, a little bit. Iron, copper. Okay. And some more silicone and stuff. Iron and, oh, you, cobalt was in those too. But not in the small ones, just iron and silicone. Okay. <coughs> Good. Okay, so we've got uh, we've got to find. I'm screwed if I can't get 290 more neo. So we've got the rest of this. The restroom. I only need two more restroom. I think we've got this. Let's let's go take a look. Let's see what we got in our um, manufacturing constructor here. Okay, power coils, flux coils. Uh, we've got Neo straight up. We've got copper cobalt alloy. Um, actually, we can just actually no. We will need that. Hmm. All right. So oscillators and energy matrix. Let's well grab all this stuff. <coughs> Uh, restroom, and, oh, capacitor devices, they have good stuff. 
Okay. You know what? I can do a computer too. Why not? Let's take a look. Let's take a look. So we need a bunch of Neo. So we need a restroom and Saskosium. I think we can get one. If we just put one in. Yeah, there we go. That gave us a uh, Neo also. Okay. So oscillators have Neo in them. Yep. Cobalt too. Sath. Okay. Capacitors have Neo in them. Yep. Iron, cobalt, it's all going up. Uh, okay, flux coils have Neo in them. Is that going to be too much? No, nope, not enough. Ugh. Are you kidding me? Even if I put all that Neo in, I'm one shy. Uh, I got to use another power coil. Oh, that sucks. You know what? I'll do it. I'll do it. Let's do a power coil. And there we go. The, now I'll be able to, I got enough to put everything. I should have enough. Let's try. Let's do this cobalt alloy. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we'll be good. We'll be good. Don't want to go too crazy there. Motors should be the three basics. Yep. Same with the computers, three basics. Uh, electronics should be just silicone and copper. Might be too much. Let's do 50. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so, Neo. Let's throw all that in. Yeah, I'm four over. Oh, well. So now I need a bunch of silicone. That's okay. <clears throat> yeah, see, this is going to totally cap us out. There we go. Okay, and then so we need 200. 217, okay. Nice, 217. Close enough. Let's start that production. Woo! We have a warp capable CV. All right. So, what I also need to do is make a bunch of. Here, let's put this stuff back. Will I have enough? Yeah, I'll have enough. Let's. Um, I don't have any in the, I didn't loot any, did I? I don't think I looted any sentry guns, did I? I might have. No, I think I put it all into the, yeah, I put it all into the um, HV spawn. I had a bunch of stuff I had looted and I threw them in. Now I think about it. Oh well, that's fine. Okay, so what do we need? We don't need any of this stuff for the CV because it's ready. It just needs fuel and all the necessities. So what do we like on fuel? Not bad. Not bad. We're doing pretty good actually. I know it's a real thirsty, there we go, lots of, uh, there we go. Okay, so I've been prepping, 
because I've been hoping that I would be able to do this. Uh, well, as I, actually, I wasn't. I was prepping for either the HV or something, but I can use all this stuff. That's perfect. Okay, so we need more fuel. Yeah, we're gonna need more fuel. More fuel. There we go. Let's make a hundred of those. And we can just put this in here for now. Good. And let's get a bunch of... Hmm. We've got lots of oxygen. We've got fuel coming. We've got ammo. Um... got a bunch of medical we can heal there we can heal on the CV hmm hmm you know what let's oops this isn't it it was this one this is my ammo fuel ammo too let's grab all this stuff okay Let's go spawn this thing in. Hmm. Where are we going to spawn it in? Where are we going to spawn it in? <clears throat> we might be able to fit it up top here. Let's take a look here. We might be able to fit it up top. Right here. Yeah. Yeah, we can put it here. Perfect. So let's spawn this in. Mini miner spawn. And oh, well, I thought it was going to be. Nope, oh, see, it will. Okay, let me just. It's just. It's just being stupid. Let me see if I can figure out a. Okay, it's a little, it's a little bigger than I thought. You know what? Maybe I'll just spawn it outside. Yeah. Let's just. Yeah, let's just spawn it outside. I I did it so that you don't need to spawn it on, um, on crap. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you don't need to spawn it on a base. <coughs> I had that setting when I, like, well, you guys will see if you went back to the start and took a look at the settings. I have those set to false. Uh, here. Actually, you know what? Let's turn this to the side. So by doing that, I need to turn to the side myself. Now I'll launch my drone. And that way I can just spawn it. Come on. And there we go. There is my mini miner. I know it's it's kind of tall and thin, but it's made like that on purpose. Uh, all the drills are actually retracted at the moment. The turrets are not retractable type. Uh, that just but it just doesn't have the space for that. Okay, so this is very Feng Shui in here. I'll, I'll give you a tour if you guys haven't seen this yet. I, I think I spawned this in before. Yeah, I spawned this in there on my construction video. You can see it. Anyway, so here we go. Here's the one cockpit. It's got full uh, 180 degrees view. Um, it's that's that that new glass, that extra thick combat glass. The whole thing is made out of combat steel too, so it can take a bit of a punch. Yes, I know that's the core right there behind the uh, the. Um, but you know what? If if they're if they are able to take out the core, that means I'm dead, right? <laughs> so it just doesn't matter. <clears throat> okay, uh, so one we. We don't have room for a fridge, but you don't need it with the uh, input 
of the food processor being uh, a cooling device, so that's good. It can it can keep things from spoiling. Uh, it's got no. Oh, I was going to show. So it, one advanced constructor. It's got uh, a bunch of harvest boxes. It's actually got four harvest boxes. You can only see two from here, but um, open this up. It's got uh, it's got warp capable. Um, it's even got a repair station in it, even though trying to get to that. I was thinking I might actually change this door. I might move the door over here. Because that way, when you open the door, you should be able to reach up and get to the... Um, get to the repair. Because right now, I'm not sure if you can get to the repair. You might be able to do without burning yourself. I'm not sure. Anyway. Uh, there we go. In a nutshell, it's made for mining. That's all it can do is really mine. Um, it, but because it's a CB. And yeah, it's, it's actually pretty minimal in the way of resources for a warp capable level 25 mining craft. It mines wicked too. It's crazy fast at mining. Okay, uh, enough of a tour of that. Let's jump in and set it up. So, turn our stuff on. What we got here? A pulse rifle. And, oh, 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 as I fall to the ground. Let's go inside here so you can see that uh, there's more of the boxes down below there. Um, I had to actually utilize some of the airtight capabilities of the uh, cargo boxes and stuff to, to utilize uh, every square inch I could to make this sealed. Um, okay, so let's jump in here. And I'm just gonna, oh. I just had to settle out after. Fill that, fill that. I don't think I have any, oh, I did. Well, there we go. <laughs> uh, it's better I use this thing to warp with any, anyway, so. Um, what else? We're gonna need... Oh, I know. Let's go. Now you can see what's great is because that door is actually occupying this block, it counts as um, being sealed. So I can stand right there at the top of the elevator and it's all sealed and that's awesome okay so let's grab our stuff <clears throat> i didn't actually get any going did i did i make some? no i didn't even make them that was stupid why didn't i make them oh because i was looking to see if i had any and i didn't so i failed uh okay sentry gun player so let's make we'll make four of them Fit. Okay. So while it's doing that, we'll put this stuff away. Um, actually, we might as well put that in there too. Okay. ready and we'll go I love the fact that this just the battery just recharges when I'm not using anything and when I do use stuff it it doesn't drain the battery enough to um, it's actually completely self-sufficient on on solar power panel this this basis I'm actually quite happy with it okay so come on 
Got a bunch of meds on us. Uh, a thousand bullets. I'm probably going to find more. We should probably grab a bunch of food. Let's do that. So. Uh, oh, yeah. Berry juice. We'll grab the fruit juice for healing. And, oh. Uh, we'll grab that for food. Okay. So I think we're golden. Um, and how's this? Is this ready? There we go. Nice. Let's put this away. Where is my food processor? Just to keep it all cool. Okay, and I'll just eat one right now. Actually, I'll eat two. <coughs> Come on. I'll find more food probably in there. Um, and if I don't, oh well, you know, that sucks. Um, hmm. I think what I'll do... Is oh yeah, I gotta change my armor out. Yeah, 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 yeah. Crap, where was it? Oh, yeah, I put a whole bunch of armor lockers in. I know. I don't know which one I had it in. Really? Okay, so what did I, where did I put it? Ah, oh, my derping, okay, so I must have put it, um, in tools. Did I leave it? Sorry guys, I, I, I have armor, I actually have, Heavy armor. Maybe I left it in here. Did I leave it in here? Yeah, I did. There we go. Okay. Uh, oh, I got a bunch more of that stuff too. And oh yeah, right. I got some some big alien flowers and stuff. Okay. That's fine. Um. Got in the way of boosts. I thought I saw another. Did I not have any more boosts? No. Uh, crap. That's gonna suck. I saw somewhere with boosts. <laughs> Sorry, guys. It was like this one? No. This one? Yeah. Uh, I don't want these, but I'll take them just to food consumption, stamina consumption, speed, acceleration, jump, armor minus 10. Yikes. Huh. I don't really have any mods, do I? Well, let's hope I find some and I can swap them out while I'm there. Okay, so, you know what? I'm just gonna leave that crap in there in my light armor. We'll put this on and we'll put this on. And I'm not really sure why I grabbed that. I don't need it. Don't need it. Yeah, we'll put it in the top one. Um, you know what? I'm going to put that there too. There we go. <clears throat> and 
and then we want to make the this one my home spawn yes and why is that going down let's um, take a look at what's going on here Ooh, it's using up a lot of power so why is that let's take a look Turn that off completely. And let's turn this off as soon as this gets to 100. Actually, let's, we'll turn it off now. Okay, and the advanced constructor, we can turn that off. We'll just turn it all off. Now let's take a look at what the consumption is. Way less. <coughs> yeah. Now it'll build up some battery, even though that it's draining right now. Uh, it should have enough battery power to not even dip into the fuel, but even if it does, it'll, it's okay. We've got, we've got enough fuel. Uh, okay, I think we're ready to go. So, yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna do it with one gun and a should I make like a a rocket? I think I can. I don't think I can make a rocket turret or a rocket. Uh, let's take take a look. Let's take a look. I don't think I even have a heavy weapons kit. Laser. Uh, what can I make? I can make a rocket launcher. Durability of 100. Durability 500. I can bump it up with an oscillator. Oh, that's not too bad. That's actually fairly easy. Rocket launcher. And maximum capacity four. Max range 200. 500 points damage. Yeah, let's do that. So we need rocket la miss launcher missile. Rocket launcher missile. We'll make one of those. And we'll see if we have rocket launcher missiles. I don't think we have any ammo, do we? Oh. Rocket launcher missile! Woo! We can make a few more, I guess. So, ammo. Okay. <clears throat> well, buddy, you're gonna... stop that or finish that down to one thank you very much and we need rocket launcher missile so this gets us five of them steel plate promethium magnesium okay five ten fifteen twenty twenty five thirty 40, 45, 50. Okay, because we got a lot of magnesium. I can't see us needing more than. F no, it won't stack. That's fine. Take that. Turn that off, and then we'll grab it. There we go. So we're going to need, we've got a lot of multi-tools. Okay, that's good. Um, you know what? We're not going to need the drill on us or in our toolbar. Now we're going to mount these. So 
so we'll mount these. Um, yeah, I'm not going to mount it directly to the light. I think I'm going to do it one block back. It's just that the, the light blows up too easy. And I'll dock. I end up docking stuff right to the back of, back of it, the uh, little mini miner HV. Looks good. And then we'll do... Um, side or something. Hmm. Yeah, good enough. There we go. So that should give us enough ground cover fire with the turrets and the sentry guns. I guess I could make more sentry guns. I just don't think I'll need them. It's just to keep keep things at bay, predators at bay. It's not like I'm trying to take out drones with them. That's what these are for. So, let's go do this. <clears throat> okay, so now that I've done that, I need to redo this. And so you can see I actually have two small cargo boxes, three large cargo boxes on here. Um, the armor locker repair station, which you can get to from from here if you're, you know, control panel. But uh, uh, what else? Medic. The O2 station. And, okay, so all the turrets, you know what, I want to separate these, so we're going to make a new group called Sentry. Okay. And what we're going to do is we're going to add these to that group that we just made. Okay, and now highlights to the next one. I'm going to just add to last group. And oh, wait, it highlighted the wrong one. Let's do that. Add to last group. <laughs> and we'll do that again and add to last group and to that one. Okay, so now that they're in their own group, I'm going to modify what this thing shoots at. I don't want it shooting at. Bases. Generators, thrusters, or warp drives, or predators, or prey. Everything else is fine. That should kill drones and troops on the ground. Okay, um, now what I want here, you know, I got to apply to group. There we go, apply to group. This one, on the other hand, I do want predator. We're not going to worry about bases. We're not going to worry about, although... No, we're not going to shoot bases. We're not going to do warp drives. We're not going to do turrets, mounted weapons, thrusters, or generators with. We're not going to do those. So just NPC, drones, players, uh, predator, and. I don't need this group because I'm not. I don't have any of those selected, right? 
subgroup. Okay, that should do it. Okay, so apply to group and we're ready to go. <clears throat> okay, so let's take a look what we got here. We've got engine, drills, custom. I'm going to make one called Sentry. Okay, now what we need to do is we want to go into, first of all, I need to reset up all my, let's just close all this crap. Uh, I need to reset up my engine group because I just nuked it by regrouping everything. At least I think I did, although I think they changed that. If a group was already, yeah, see, it already has the engines. Good, okay, so that's good. Uh, that's good, good, good. Good, 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 good. Okay, so uh, the engines group is good. What we need is the sentry gun group. So we're going to put this in the sentry group. Okay. Uh, also, this. I've got shortcutted to drills so that I can turn off the harvest separately now. You can see that you can actually individually turn them off and on now. So that's fantastic. They finally they finally added on and off switches to a whole bunch of items that didn't have it before. Uh, like fridges and stuff like that. It's like, well, if you know, sure I've got it I've got it hooked up. I just don't have anything in it right now. I don't want it running. Thank you very much. I don't want to remove it off the wall. Just, I just want to turn it off. Yeah, so they've done that now uh, with the drill modules, which is great because um, you can see they've also set up idle power on devices that, that aren't turned off, that are turned on but not being used. So your drills don't eat up that 100 kilowatts anymore. Uh, what they do is they eat up um, 16 kilowatts if you're not using them and 820 if you are. <laughs> so 6 times 820, I actually go over the, it, it, I can't quite fully power them. I probably got to put another generator on the, on the little, um, oh, these are, these are the CV ones anyway, but on the on the HV, it's the same same sort of thing. Anyway, uh, so now that we've got those set up, we should be able to just turn those on, turn those on, turn those on, turn those on, turn those on. Now, technically, you can see here. I'm gonna alt so so you can see the the drills came out. As you can see, they uh, they've they've projected out now that they've gotten turned on. Uh, and then if I turn the drills off, oh, why did it turn the turrets and weapons? Why did it turn all my turrets off? Did it actually do that? Why did it do that? It's on drills. Ah, I don't have this on a, but it showed them all off. Okay, whatever. They're still on. Um, you know what? Maybe I'll call, maybe I'll make another one. I'll, I'll call it mini guns. I don't know why. Just because, <laughs> just because, and we'll put those here. Okay, and then so that's on because they're all on right now. Okay, so turrets and weapons. So I'm not sure why it should have shown it partially on. Oh, there we go. So it does for that, but not for the 
drills. Okay, whatever. We're just whatever. Uh, see, I, I was expecting when I turned. Oh. Okay, now it's doing it. Because it's a partial. All the way off. Partially on. Partially on. Turrets and weapons. So now I should be able to regulate mini guns, sentries. And drills. Okay. <laughs> so now I should be able to just turn off the drills. Let's see. Is everything else powered? Yeah, the other the lights are on the other guns there are the lights on the uh, can't see are the lights on the sentry. Let's see. We'll go into them. Yep, they're active. Okay, so that works. It's just displaying funky. That's fine. Let's go. So, approach the compound. Really? Well, hmm. I'm not so sure if I want to do that that way. I think we go check this out. I remember from the multiplayer that this had a warp in it, or a teleport that teleported listed A to the deeper into the um, compound. Oops. Let's get above the uh, okay. Is my lights on? sentries on. God, it shows them. Do I do that? Whatever. Whatever. <laughs> it's just the drills. I don't need the drills. Okay, so the sentry guns are turned on now. And yes, they are, because they are now shooting. So what are they shooting at? I'm not sure. It'll be spiders or something over there. Yeah, lots of spiders. here. See, 
that's why I wanted to bring a CV, because because an HV can't fly. Tracting the landing gear weren't behaving. Okay, so there we go. Um, if any critters come at me, the guns should take care of them. Yeah, and it's nice that we're down in a little dip so that the guns are actually shooting forever at stuff that it can't reach. Yeah, it can reach that. Let's see if it kills it. What is it shooting at? <sighs> the crickets it thinks are alien or or like predators for some reason. I don't know why. That's really annoying. Oh well. Okay. So we can turn off the engines. And whoop. <laughs> As it falls over. Uh, we'll keep the lights on. Don't really have to worry about the oxygen. Uh, I'm not going to make this my home spawn. Okay. So, we're going to grab some food. And fruit juice. I think I want that down there. Okay. Okay. Um, you know what? I don't need all this freaking fuel. Let's. Dump that. I don't need any of the oxygen. Might need the drill. Shotgun, I might need the shells. Might need the O2, I don't know. Uh, everything else I need, so. Always have a drill and drill charges with you, always. That one's kind of damaged, but there's a bell left. Uh, durability of 181, it's good enough for now, okay. So in case I die, I don't lose all that fuel and oxygen. I can replace all this stuff easy enough, but that's a pain in the ass. I can replace everything easy enough. Okay. Whew. This is gonna be intense. Okay, so let's take a look what's in here. So it's got a alien core. It's powered up. Drone it up just in case there's sentry guns or something, right? Oh, see, there's a teleporter. <sighs> That's all there is in here. That's it. Geronimo. Will this oh it does. Ooh. Not sure. Okay, so that teleport to alien tower, alien watch tower. And to switch lever. Oh am I supposed to switch a lever? What what's in here? Ooh, fuel. What about here? Oh, it didn't blow up. Can I see anything? No. <laughs> uh, I don't know if I should pull the switch. Okay, here we go. Let's pull the switch. Three, two, one. And next episode, 
we will be pulling the switch and continuing with the Robson protocol. Until then, you guys have yourselves an awesome, awesome day.